Hey again, everyone. Uh, excuse the face, the clothes, everything. It's a declutter day here at the house, and this is what I look like when I declutter. I don't know what you look like, but I wear ratty clothes and um, things I don't care about messing up. But anyway, this is just going to be a really quick video. I want to announce something that I'm going to be starting tomorrow, July 1st, 2016. For the entire month of July, I am giving away um, my a lot of my stash of yarn, crochet books, um, whatever else I can find that has to do with crocheting. So if you crochet, if you knit, um, you might want to tune in to my channel in the next couple of days. I'll also have a blog post where I'll have detailed pictures and I will um, give you all the details on that and I'll put a link to that in this video and the next video when I get them done. Um, I've been going through the let's see this book and I know this is going to be backwards on the video but it's um, the life-changing magic of tidying up by Marie Kondo and I haven't been following it exactly right but uh, I decided to tackle my yarn and um, craft supplies um, I love to crochet. My grandmother taught me to crochet when I was a small child, and I absolutely love it. And a few years ago, when crochet was so big as far as clothing goes, I got in my head that I was going to make all of these skirts for my nieces, and uh, wraps, and sweaters, and blah, 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 blah. And so I bought all this yarn and all these books, and I discovered that I'm not very good at that part. <laughs> I'm really good at making afghans. Um, but as far as anything wearable, I'm really not. Um, anything that I need a pattern for, I don't enjoy. And so a lot of it just sat in the bins and has been taking up space. I also have uh, an entire bin of crochet thread and um, I thought I would enjoy that because I do like the intricate details in thread, not necessarily the color changes, um, but the lace, I, I, I like that. I think that's very pretty. But I, I didn't enjoy it at all. I, I want to keep the hooks because a lot of them were my grandmother's. Um, but none of the yarn was hers. None of the um, the thread was hers. So I don't um, want to hang on to that for sentimental reasons. But the hooks I, I, I do want to keep. So... Having said all that, um, I'm going to give away a lot of this stuff. Um, I'm going to ask that anybody who wants it just please pay for postage. Um, and I haven't figured out exactly all the details, but whatever cost I have to package it up, if I have to buy envelopes or boxes or whatever. Um, I don't want to make any money on this. Um, I, I just don't want to lose any money either. But uh, this is not to make money. This is just to, to get some of this stuff out of my house and hopefully get it into the hands of someone who will enjoy it and will use it and will make beautiful, beautiful objects out of it. Um, and the only thing that I ask is if you do make something of it out of it, please send me a picture. I'd love to see it. Um, I, I do still love to look at crocheted items. I just don't necessarily always love to, to do them. I do, like I said, I do love to make afghans and scarves and things like that that don't really... I like to just be able to sit 
down and watch a football game or whatever it is I'm watching and crochet and not have to think about it. Um, I have to think about things too often in my life and um, crochet is something for me that I don't want to have to think about. I just want to do it. Um, I don't want to have to figure anything out. The hardest thing I want to figure out is what color is next <laughs> when I'm crocheting something. Not how do I do this stitch or this stitch pattern. I, I don't. That's not where I am right now in my life. Maybe at another time in my life I will be. But as of right now, I'm not. And some of this stuff has been in my house for six, seven, eight years, maybe. And uh, it's time to go. It's time for it to go. So um, be looking out tomorrow. And I'm only going to do this in July. Anything that's left at the end of July, I'm donating to Goodwill or Salvation Army or something like that. And the only reason that I didn't do that to begin with is because I, I kind of want to make sure that uh, these things go to somebody who will use them and wants them to, to make beautiful things with them. And... Um, if I could get a picture of it, that would be great. <laughs> so, be on the lookout tomorrow. And um, I hope that if you crochet or knit, that you can find something that you, you'd like. Some, find something useful. And that it would be a blessing for you. Because it has been a blessing for me. I've really enjoyed feeling that connection to my grandmother. Um, through crochet but I'm also trying to be a realist that there's some things about it that I don't really enjoy and I'm reaching a point in my life that I just want to do things I want to have things in my life that are enjoyable not um, not things that make me feel guilty so uh, we'll see you tomorrow, July 1st, and uh, thank you so much for watching. Fly high, Pooh Bear.